Hi guys, welcome to Pilates with Hannah and today we're going to have a fist full body workout. And trust me, this is going to be fierce. And we're going to focus on all the major muscles including triceps, abs and quads. So when you're ready, roll out your mat and let's begin. Alright, so let's begin by allowing yourself to lie down on your stomach. Now pull your body button in, make a pillow under your forehead here. Open your legs here with your part and press your shoulder towards your hips here, belly button in. And when you do inhale, lift one leg up, activate your feet and bring it down to the other side. Now I want you to press your hip bones down. So inhale deeply, lift all the way up the mat and exhale, do it, bring it down to the other side. Eight more times with your own breath, squeeze in your thigh, lengthen your leg. And seven, keep breathing. Inhale up and exhale down. Six, squeeze your butt and feel your legs connecting to each other. Feel like someone pulling your legs away from the center. Okay. Now five more times each side. Inhale, exhale down through your mouth. Inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth. And four. To the other side, do it slowly with your own breath and use the breath to control the movement. Okay. Three more times. To your left, contract your pelvic floor muscle, your belly button in to support your lower back. And show you far away from your ears. Two. Lift and down to your left and bring it down last time. Inhale, lengthen, exhale, come back and to the other side. Very good, bring it down. Now shoulder your hips a little bit from here. I want you to press your shoulder toward your hips again and pull your body button in. Lift one leg up and the other leg up here. Now activate your feet. Inhale and start to beat your heels together 10 times with your own breath. Belly button in, squeeze it in your thighs, inhale, and extend it in. And seven, six, five, keep breathing, four, lengthen, and engage your core to make sure that you support your lower back. Two, and one, slowly bring your legs down. Should you from that to right? Very good. Now, from here, I want you to inhale and slowly bend one knee up and to the other side stick your toes together and now slowly lift your leg up and bring it down into your core as much as possible lift and down shoulder press down towards your hips too belly button in to support your lower back and do it five more times with your own breath four three try to reach a little bit higher up Two, inhale, lift, exhale, down, and last time, lift, bring it down. Now, I want you to open your legs and keep it curled on here. Inhale, and exhale, slowly lift one leg up and lengthen. Come back and knee bend and bring it down. Knee up and lengthen your leg, bend the knee and bring it down. Keep breathing 10 times each side. And down, squeeze it in your thigh, pull your body button in. Engage your core as much as possible. And to the other side, make sure that you squeeze in the thighs together and contract your pelvic floor muscle here, belly button in. Lengthen to stabilize your hips. Lengthen, bring it back and down to the other side and come back, bring it down. So six more times with your own breath to your left, lengthen. Back to your right, inhale up, lengthen, exhale, bend and down, inhale and exhale slowly, very good, two, to the other side, beautiful, and last time, inhale, lift, lengthen, come back, down, to the other side, lengthen, come back, and down, very good. Now show your hips from left to right. From here, I want you to slowly put your hand neck to your chest and press your shoulder towards your hips here. Now lengthen your legs, press your legs down and open your leg hip with the part. 
So inhale, lengthen your neck here, and slowly press your torso off the mat. Exhale, come back. Make sure you close your elbows to the back, and exhale, bring it back, and stick your hip bones down to the mat. So only your torso is moving here, belly button in to, to lengthen your neck, and don't put a lot of pressure on it. Very good. And we try to do it five more times. Inhale up. Engage your core. Exhale down. Three. Two. Keep breathing. Use your breath to control the movement. And last time. Inhale. And exhale slowly. Bring it down. Shift it from left to right. Very good. Now from here, I want you to inhale. Still keep your arms here and touch your feet. Now slowly close your elbows to the back, shoulder down, belly button in. Now I want you to inhale and press your body up and exhale, bring it down. Inhale, lift and exhale, down, belly button in. And we do it six more times with your own breath. Inhale, lift and exhale, down. And five, four, keep breathing, inhale, lift it up. And so bring it down, belly button in, squeeze your butt. Two. And last time, lift and slowly bring it down. Shake his from left to right. Very good. Now from here, I want you to slowly bring your arms to the ulator here and press your shoulder towards your hips. Belly button in, lengthen your neck, inhale. And so slowly bring your torso up and bring so bring it down. Make sure you keep your belly button in to support your lower back. Beautiful. And we'll do it six more times. With your own breath, make sure you lengthen your neck. Look down to the mat here. And use your core to roll up and down. Inhale up, exhale down. So three, keep breathing. Don't hold your breath. Inhale and exhale. Two. And last time, slowly bring it down. Shut your hips from left to right. Now from here. I want you to slowly interlace your fingers together into uh, in front of your chest. Now push your shoulder far away from your ears. Pull your belly button in. Squeeze your butt. Now inhale, double tap with your foot, and to the other side, bend your knee. Press your hip bones down to the mat, and make sure your hips stabilize. So we try to do it six more times each side. Squeeze in the thighs together, and belly button in. Four, to your left, three, look down to the top of the mat, lengthen your neck here, and to your left, last time, to your right, and last time, to your left, bring it down. From here, I want you to interlace your finger to the back. Now, put your trick on one side, belly button in. Now, imagining that you have a string bending knee, you have a string between your feet and your arms, when you lengthen your arm, the string pull up. So your torso lift it up and you turn the trick to another side. Inhale and exhale, lift it up. Exhale, come back, belly button in. And we try to do it five more times each side. Make sure you pull your belly button in to protect the lower back. So lift and down and lift and bring it down. Lengthen your neck, look down to the mat and lift your arms up. Engage your core as much as possible. Two more times. Squeeze your butt here. And last time, to your right. Last time, to your left. And slowly let go of your arms to the front. And lengthen your leg and shake your hips from left to right. Very good. Now from here, open your legs hip with the part again. And then bring your head over your head. So slide back to make sure that your shoulder is far away from your ears here. Inhale and look down to the mat, lengthen your neck, slowly bring one arm and opposite leg up and bring it down, belly button in to the other side, lengthen and feel like someone pulling your arms and leg in opposite way and far from the center. Lift and bring it down, activate your feet and keep breathing to the other side. Make sure you keep your hip bones down to the mat so you stick down to the mat and don't move that hips. Only leg is moving and arms are moving here. Great. And we do it five more times each side. To your left. Four. Inhale. Exhale back. Inhale up. And exhale down. Two. 
to the other side and last time inhale lift exhale down to the other side and bring it down shaking it from left to right great now the next movement is i want you to inhale and bring both arms and legs up and start to swimming pumping your hand and opposite leg this key thing here is i want you to stabilize your hips and press it down belly button in Engage your core as much as possible. Squeeze in the thighs and we try to do it for five, four, three, two, and one. Slowly bring it down. Take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Good. Now from here, when you're ready, slowly roll yourself back to tripod position. Inhale, take a deep breath again. And exhale through your nose, through your mouth. And come up to all position. Now from here, put your shoulder far away from your ears. Open your arms, shoulder apart, and open your legs a bit apart here. Your hips is on top of your knees, and your shoulder is on top of your wrist. So inhale, eyes and elbows rotate to each other, and tuck the feet. Lift your knees up and bring it down. Couple more times here with your own breath, and lengthen your neck. Look down to the mat. Belly button in. Squeeze your butt here. Six. Keep breathing. Five, four, three, two, and last time. Bring it down. Take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Very good. Now from here, I want you to move your knees further away uh, a little bit to the back and then lift your heels up. So I want you to shift your weight to the front so your shoulder is on top of your wrist here. Inhale and exhale. Push down and up. So I want you to always keep your elbows closer to your body. And we do it five more times with your own breath. Engage your core and squeeze your butt here. Inhale and exhale up. Three, two, and last time. Inhale down and hold it here for three, two, and one slowly lengthen yourself and allow yourself to lie down on the mat again. Shoot your hips from left to right. Now from here, I want you to slowly bring your hand to the side, your arms to the side, lengthen your arms, shoulder down far away from your ears, and slowly inhale, open, lift your one arm up and bring it down. So we try to open the shoulder here to the back. Inhale, lift, and exhale down. You can lift your head just a little bit off the mat and lengthen. Come back into your core as much as possible and we try to do it two, five more times each side to your right to your left and four keep breathing squeeze your butt squeeze in the thighs and press your hip bones down two to the left and last time to the other side come back and slowly allow yourself to come back to tripod position here. Take a deep breath, inhale deeply, and exhale deeply. All right, now from here, I want you to slowly come to on board position again. Now pull your belly button in, tuck your feet, inhale, and exhale slowly, lift your knees up, lengthen one leg, come back, and lengthen. Make sure you keep your hips balanced here, so only one leg is moving, and your torso is Stabilize. Lengthen the neck, look to the front of the, look down to the mat. And four, keep breathing. Three, two, and last time. Lengthen, come back, knees down, take a deep breath, round your spine, chin to chest, and then articulate your spine, look up to the ceiling, cat and core, and round again. Each vertebra at a time, squeeze in the thighs, squeeze your butt, five more times before we continue to do the other side lift and round belly button in to the other side very good keep breathing here bone by bone exhale chin your chest and last time and bring your back back to neutral here now from here lengthen your leg to the other side inhale lift your knees up and lengthen shoulder on top of your wrist here inhale and exhale bend your knees and come back couple more times here with your own breath 
stabilize your hips and your torso. So we do it four more times with your own breath. Three. Keep breathing, squeezing your thighs. And last time, lengthen, come back, knees down. Have your knee to your chest, still a breath. Try to pose. Inhale deeply and extend deeply. Very good. And when you're ready, allow yourself to stay up on your knees here, on your heels here. So, keep, sit tall with your back in neutral, belly button in, shoulder down and open your chest. Now bring your arms to the front, inhale, belly button in, exhale, lift up and hands up and bring it down. Inhale all the way up and exhale down. Squeeze your inner thighs, contract your pelvic floor muscle and squeeze your butt together. Lift and down. Make sure you keep the back in neutral. You can tuck your tailbone forward when you lift it up and squeeze your butt and come back. So we do it five more times. Inhale up, exhale down, four, and shoulder down. Open your chest, lift, belly button in, two, keep breathing. And last time, inhale, lift, and exhale, bring it down. And take a deep breath here, inhale, and exhale. Very good. Now from here, I want you to slowly bring your arm to the side, soften your elbows, inhale, and exhale, lift your arms all the way up to the ceiling. Exhale, rotate the torso to your left. Come back, lift your arms, and to your right, and bring it back. Make sure that you still keep your hips facing forward when you bring it up and down, and you try to do it eight more times. Each side, lift, and seven to your right, lift, to your left, keep breathing. And inhale up, exhale down. Five, lift. Keep breathing here and use the breath to control the movement. And five more times, inhale down, exhale lift to the other side. Tuck the tailbone forward, squeeze your butt and bring it down. Two more times with your own breath, lift. And last time to your right, come back. Last time to your left, and bring it back. And arms down, rotate the shoulder here, and reverse. Very good. And when you're ready, I want you to come to sit in the middle of the mat here. Now open your legs here with the part. And bend your knees, keep your feet flat. Sit tall with your back neutral, pull your belly button in. Bring your arms to the front, inhale deeply. And exhale slowly, face forward. Inhale, come back, shoulder down. Exhale, flex forward. And come back. And we'll draw it six more times here with your own breath. Five. Shoulder down. Four. Three. Keep breathing. Try to reach a little bit more, lengthen the neck here. And try to reach your thrust to the thighs and come back, shoulder down. Last time, exhale. And inhale back, arms down, take a deep breath. Now slowly bring your head to your left and come back to your right and bring it back to the center. One more time. And look down to your left shoulder and slowly come back, look down to your right shoulder and hold it here for two and one, come back to the center. Very good. Now from here, I want you to slowly lengthen your leg Open your leg here with a part and keep your feet dorsi flex here. Shoulder down. Now I want you to put your head behind your body. Pull your finger to the back. Open the chest and pull your belly button in here. Dorsi flex. Inhale and exhale. Slide your heels closer to your butt and come back. And to the other side. Squeeze your inner thighs. Bring it back. Eight more times each side with your own breath. To the other side. Look to the front and shoulder far away from your ears so we don't try to move your, your spine round like this but try to open and pull your belly button in and keep your shoulder down very good and we do it six i mean five more times each side to the other side inhale and exhale lengthen squeeze in the thighs and four to the other side three keep breathing squeeze in the thighs Contract your pelvic floor muscle and slowly move with your breath. 
three, to your right, two, to your right, and last time, to your left, to your right, and the very last time to your left, to make it balance on both sides. Very good. Now shake your legs a little bit here. Now keep the legs together and point your toes to the front. Now forearms down, shoulder on top of your elbows. Activate your feet. Open your chest, put your chest up, belly button in. I want you to inhale and lift one leg up. Now bring it down and lift and bring it down. Eight more times on one side. Make sure you stick your hips and your sitting bones down to the mat. So only your leg is moving up and down. The other leg and your torso is stabilized and press down to the mat. Forearms down, belly button in and four more times. With your own breath, three, two, keep breathing. And last time, bring it down to the other side. Inhale, lift, exhale down, and lift, and down. Activate your feet. Beautiful. And we try to do it a couple more times here with your own breath. Inhale deeply, exhale deeply, and squeeze in the thighs together. Feel your legs connecting. Take your other into the hips here. Squeeze and work your hips flexor. Beautiful, lift and down. Inhale up, exhale down, belly button in. Last time, slowly bring it down, shake hips from the to your right. Very good. Now I want you to inhale and slowly allow yourself to lie down on your back. So this time, keep your back in neutral, belly button in. Now, hands along your body and press it down, reach your hand towards your heels here. Inhale deeply, slowly bring one leg up, activate your foot, slowly lengthen. And come back 10 times with your own breath. Keep breathing. Lift and down and lift and bring it down. And five more times with your own breath. Five. Keep breathing. Feel as I'm pulling your leg all the way up. So try to straighten it and reach and come down. Two. And last time, slowly down and bring your leg down to the other side. Activate your foot again. Try to lengthen. Come back. And nine more times with your own breath. Lift, bring it down, squeeze in the thighs. Seven. And six. Five, keep breathing, don't hold your breath here. Three. Two, reach. And last time, lengthen, bring it back and bring your leg down. Now this time, I want you to open your arms to the side and now open, bend your legs and then keep your feet flat. Lift your arms up and inhale, palms facing up to the ceiling and point your palms down and up. Rotate your arms here, inhale and exhale. Feel the gravity of, on your arms, inhale and exhale. And nine, eight, seven, keep breathing naturally. Belly button in, keep your back neutral. And four, three, two, and last time, arms up and slowly bring your arms down. Now this time, I want you to inhale, bring one arm up, palms facing down, and try to press the other arms down to the mat. So I want you to reach to your right, come back, reach, and bring it back. Stretch your arms and your shoulder a little bit here. So six, five, four, three, two, and last time, bring your arm down and to the other side, inhale, try to reach your left, come back and reach, stretch your shoulder, stretch your arm. Very good. And we'll do it five more times with your own breath. Four, three, two, and one, slowly come back. Very good. Now bring your arms up to 90 degrees here and palms facing each other, inhale and exhale, slowly lift it just above the floor, inhale and exhale, lengthen and come back and lengthen and bring it back. So we try to do it four more times here, up and come back, very good. Feel your biceps and triceps are working here with only the gravity and your body weight, beautiful. And we try to do it five. Four, keep breathing, three, two, and last time. Now bring your arms all the way down, palms facing down, and start to make a little pause here with your own breath. So nine, eight, seven, 
six, five, four, three, two, and one. Now slowly rotate, small circle around your arms here. And keep breathing naturally here. In five, four, three, feel the balance on both shoulders and arms. And one, reverse. 10 more rounds with your own breath. Keep breathing. And belly button is to keep the back in neutral here. So we do it five, four, keep breathing. Three, two, and one. Slowly bring your arms down. Shake your shoulder a little bit, shake your hips a little bit here. Now belly button in as well your body. And I want you to bring one leg up to the other side. Activate your feet here. Stick your heels and your nose together. Now head and shoulder off the mat. And I want you to bring your arm along your body here. So reach your hand forward, lift your chest a little bit more and change your chest to protect your neck and start to pump in your hand. Inhale five times and exhale five times. If you want more challenge, lengthen your leg to 45 degree, press your shoulder toward your hips and your belly button in. So we try to do it eight more times with your own breath. Inhale and exhale through your mouth. Inhale, two, three, four, five. Exhale, two, three, four, five. Stick your lower back down to the mat. Squeeze it in the thighs together and keep breathing here. In five, exhale. Inhale, and exhale. Three, keep breathing. If you feel tired on your neck, you always can use your hand to support your neck. And lift your chest, lift your chest a little bit more. Scoop your belly and two. Last time. And slowly have to meet your chest. Take a deep breath here. Head down, shoulder down. Take a deep inhale. And exhale through your mouth. And one more time here. Now I want you to hug your knee to your chest and lengthen the other leg. Take a deep breath here. Inhale deeply. And exhale deeply. Rotate your ankle and reverse to the other side. Hug it and take a deep inhale and exhale. Rotate your ankle, reverse. All right. Now from here, I want to slowly bring your legs to 90 degree again. Keep your back in neutral and don't arch your back. Pull your belly button in, arms along your body here. Now inhale, lengthen one leg to 45 degree and open it to the side. Make sure you engage your core and stabilize your hips here so your hips is not moving. And come back and bend to the other side. Open it to the side, come back and open it one more time and bring it back. Bend your knee, so lengthen to the other side and come back. Very good. Now bend your knee back. Make sure that you keep your belly button in and don't arch your back here. Shoulder down far away from your ears. Come back to your right. Open, bring it back and open. Keep breathing and use the breath to control the movement. Very good. Lengthen and bring it back. So three to your right. Come back central and to your right. Back and bend to the other side. Lengthen and back and lengthen and bring it back. Bend your knee here two more times with your own breath. Keep breathing, keep stabilized and back neutral. Navel to spine. Last time, open and come back to your right. Bring it back and to your left. Lengthen, open, come back and open and bring it to the center. You have to need your chest. Take a deep breath, inhale. And exhale. Very good. Now from here, I want you to slowly bring one leg to the ceiling. Pull your toes up to the ceiling. Bend one knee down and press your heels down here. Inhale and exhale slowly. Bring it to the side and come to the side. Lift it all the way up and come back. And to the side, all the way up. Bring it down. So we like drawing a half of the circle. But make sure that you stabilize your hips here so your hips are not moving. And you can put your hand on the opposite hip bones to stabilize it. And press it down, belly button in. And keep breathing here. So three, 
to activate the foot. And last time, bring it back, have the knee to your chest, and then bend your knee down, and change to the other side, put it on your opposite hip bone. Lift your leg all the way up to the ceiling, and open your right arm, press it down, inhale, and exhale, bring it down, and come back. Come to half circle here, and bring it back all the way up to the ceiling. We try to do it a couple more times with your own breath. Inhale halfway and exhale halfway. Inhale and exhale. Rotate your knee to the side when you're bringing it back. And work your legs. Alright, and we'll do it three more times so with your own breath. Keep breathing. Inhale and exhale. Come back to. Make sure you press your hip bones down last time here. All the way up to the ceiling, half the knee to your chest, and slowly bring your legs down. Shut your hips from to the right. Now, from here, I want you to slowly lift your head and your shoulder off the mat and use your hand to support it. So, open your elbow to the side, keep your feet flat here. Inhale and exhale, reach up and bring down, and exhale, reach and down. And we try to do it six more times with your own breath. So, not just your head, but try to lift. Your chest a little bit more and still keep lengthening your neck here. Open your elbows wider. And two, keep breathing. Last time, slowly bring it down. Take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale through your mouth. Very good. Now, from here, I want you to slowly lean to one side and sit up. Sit tall with your back in neutral, neutral belly button in, shoulder down and open your chest. Inhale deeply through your nose and exhale deeply through your mouth. And now hand on opposite knee, open your back to the back. Hold it here for three, two, and one. Slowly come back to the other side and hold it here for a few seconds and come back to the center. Now right spine, chin your chest and then articulate your spine. Look up to the ceiling. Open the chest and exhale. Come back one more time here. Round the spine. Look up and exhale. Round the spine. Chin the chest and bring it back to the center. And that's the workout for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And please subscribe to this channel. You can see new workout every day. See you tomorrow. Bye.